Hello, my name is Carl. I am Two Echo Zero, Echo Zulu Tango. I am a intermediate uh, licensed radio amateur from the UK. I always encourage people to uh, leave a comment, to like or dislike the, the video and also please press that subscribe button because all this activity really helps me to generate better content because I know what you guys actually prefer when you interact with the videos so thank you very much for the activity so far okay so <clears throat> I just wanted to cover a few things here um, over the, over this weekend it's uh, the weekend of the 10th it's Sunday the 10th of February 2019 and there's been uh, there's been some fun activity happening with the International Space Station so uh, over the weekend it's been the uh, International Space Station have been running a um, slow scan TV experiment <clears throat> for about three days now so um, over the over the weekend they've been sending out a number of images using the slow scan TV mode so um, <clears throat> a lot of radio amateurs have been able to decode the images as the space station passes overhead so I, over the weekend I've managed to use my SatNogs amateur satellite tracking uh, station so I've managed to uh, get quite a few recordings of the satellite and uh, I've been using an app called Robot36 to decode the audio into the images so that's been fun so it just goes to show that in the amateur radio hobby there's lots of different parts of the hobby that are very enjoyable different modes that you can you, you can use uh, I know that a lot a lot of uh, amateur radio operators use FT8 nowadays it's becoming very popular but I wonder what modes you like to use so please can you drop into the comments below uh, any different types of modes or things that you do with the the hobby other than using maybe just voice or CW or FT8 what other modes are going on because there's so much to do in this hobby I don't think we give some of the other modes enough <clears throat> um, enough time to enjoy them uh, another update is I <clears throat> next weekend uh, I'm hopefully going to my first amateur radio rally called the Radio Active Rally in Nantwich run by the Mid Cars which is the uh, Mid Cheshire Radio um, Amateur Group so uh, hopefully I'll be taking my camera and I'll get a, a few bits of video and piece that together after next weekend <clears throat> um, Today I've scheduled out another video where I activate a trig point in quite stormy conditions so that's that's currently now on the channel uh, next week I've got scheduled a another video where I take out four types of <clears throat> uh, handheld radios and compare them against each other so that's scheduled for next Sunday so um, don't forget to subscribe and they, they can press that bell button and you'll get notification when the videos are coming out. Um, I just, I've also want to say thank you to Bill for the email. So I got a fantastic email this morning and uh, I'll just um, read this. So this is Bill, um, Victor Echo 3, Foxtrot uh, India um, from Kingston, and Ontario. Uh, he used to live in Liverpool but now he lives in Canada. He sent me uh, two fantastic attachments on my email. One of them is a printable prefix guide for when I'm when I'm portable. Um, there was a video a few weeks ago where I was out portable and I heard some new call signs and I couldn't look them up because I didn't have any signal on my phone. So I had no way to look up those uh, prefixes. He's given me a printable guide, which is a, a fantastic idea. He's also given me a <clears throat> a printable log page, uh, which is really good timing because the log book that I tend to use, the, the, the line's so thin, when I'm out portable, so difficult to write neatly within the line. So he's given me 
a really uh, well spaced out logbook so I think that uh, should come in handy so I'm going to print those out when I get into my other office uh, this week um, back at the university this week so I'll, um, I'll I'll print them out so thank you very much Bill for, for those goodies what else is there uh, okay so I am I I recorded my first uh, grab and go video and I've deleted it um, the quality it was rushed I didn't I didn't enjoy getting that first video together I'm still going to do this series of grab and go uh, gear for you know getting out the house very quickly and working portable I just need to find a, a method of recording the the different camera angles and then really have a good look at the gear so uh, it is coming it might take a week or two to get the time to put those videos together but uh, I will eventually do the grab and go series I have just put out the new video on Friday which is the big the beginners guide uh, the first one's gone out on Friday I've got two more coming I'll see how they, how well they do on uh, YouTube um, please drop any comments in for ideas of what I could cover in, in very short videos for absolute beginners uh, that would you know that would be really handy so I, I can then have a look at the whole series of them and consider you know should I you know hopefully I'll continue with that um, but if if the videos tank then I may just uh, hold back on them for a bit so um, uh, the weather in the UK is awful at the moment, so um, there's no planned outing this weekend. It's a, it's a birthday weekend in the family, so it means that um, we get to go out and eat lots of good food. So um, it's, I've still got one in the can for next weekend, and then hopefully I've got the rally. So that'll be another video coming out, and then that it gives me enough... Um, enough videos ahead so that I can get more videos into the can so we've got a steady schedule going on so the schedule still is Wednesday for the midweek chat and um, Friday I'm dropping in these uh, at the moment these beginners guides and Sundays hopefully the outing the getting out the house bit so that's it for the moment um, please um, don't don't be afraid to uh, drop in any comments and have a chat it's been great getting the the conversations in the threads and the in the comments. It's really uh, I really appreciate that. So thank you very much for that, and uh, looking forward to the next one. So bye bye for now.